Right now, Logan Erickson and his dog Duke are getting acquainted at Four Paws for Ability in Xenia. The one-of-a-kind organization trains service dogs to help kids with special needs. Despite the crowd of people and pets around him, Logan Erickson sits quietly playing with pebbles. The 10-year-old autistic boy and his family traveled thousands of miles from their home in remote Unicolid, Alaska to Four Paws for Ability in Xenia to meet Duke, a Labrador retriever. We see this as a new page and a new opportunity for him to have a better life. Jeff Erickson says it's a day of hope. It's been months in the making and started during the famous Iditarod dog race. Logan met one of the mushers and afterwards broke his lifelong silence. She noticed that Logan and her dog had a bond and he had never spoken before and when she left, Logan said the dog's name. So that was very touching for me as a mother because he's never talked before. What seemed like a miracle for the family is less surprising for the folks at Four Paws for Ability who see those special bonds all the time. We see it every day. We call it magic. We don't know what else to call it because in some ways, you know, you can understand that the dogs are simple and the kids can understand them. Karen Shirk is founder and executive director of the service dog training organization. She says Logan's new dog, Juke, will work with his special needs to help him not only grow, but also stay safe. Juke will be trained to track Logan in a matter of seconds, should he wander off. Well, he disappears so fast that, that we've had several incidences where he's gotten what we thought was lost. He could be 50 feet away, but he just disappears. Um, but he's also gone under the ice. You know, we live 250 feet from the Bering Sea, and he went under the ice getting out in the springtime when it was melting. And the Ericsons hope those close calls are a thing of the past and instead look forward to a long and happy future with their newest four-legged family member. Now getting a service dog like Juke is expensive. Folks involved with the Iditarod and Eagle Pack Pet Food came together to pay for half of the $30,000 it cost. Eagle Pack is also donating dog food for Juke for the rest of his life. Reporting live, Megan O'Rourke, 2 News on your side.